In this a crisis there, Wisconsin just set a record for new COVID-19 cases, prompting Governor Tony Evers to plead that people stay home and wear a mask if you have to go out in public. The surges we're seeing across the state are not an indication that masks don't work. Masks only work if everyone wears them. So here's what the numbers look like there. Yesterday, the Wisconsin Department of Health reported 2,887 positive cases, continuing a trend of 2,000 or more new cases daily in the past week. Another 21 deaths were reported yesterday as well. And the Wisconsin Department of Health Services also says 45 Wisconsin counties are reporting very high COVID-19 activity, with 41 more showing a growing traje trajectory. Despite the surge in cases, there's still a clear divide on the best course of action for the state. Now a lot of response to this story on our Carolyn Facebook page. This person on Twitter is against another lockdown saying let the state stay open. Let the college kids attend class and allow the economy to rebound. College campuses like UW La Crosse and UW Madison have seen a big spike in COVID cases among students and staff. Now, on the other hand, Michelle wrote this on our Facebook page. 65 people have died in the last three days. How many more have to die before the state takes it seriously? Governor Evers didn't announce any new shutdowns yesterday, but will allow licensed out of state health professionals to care for patients in Wisconsin as hospitals in the Green Bay area are approaching capacity. So some very dire news out of the Wisconsin area. Of yeah. course, I have my parents live mm -hmm. there. My sister lives there. And when we went there, you know, crossing the border, I was shocked to see how many people weren't wearing face masks. Yeah, I think a lot of people are questioning, you know, um, because I mean, we're, we're so close to the border, you know, how often they want right. to make the travels to see friends and family right now. Alicia, thanks.